Welcome, this is the Energy Vibration Reading for the Sun, Moon, and Rising Cancers. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. This is uh, the second week of the second week of November 2017. And I want to say thanks for um, being here. And again, um, welcome all new subscribers. And I want to apologize to all the people who have reached out to me for readings. And it was either late or something. My apologies. I was sick and I'm trying to move. So um, this is really what has happened. Okay, it is the second week of November 2017. And the week is going to begin um, with um, the energy of... Uh, um, you have the energy of... Uh, um, 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 the hair sign okay so it's is the element of hair and the zodiac energy of water you are a water sign so it's going to be a wonderful week as I'm looking at your week it's going to be good the number six is going to be your energy vibration we have this um, so we have a water sign on Monday which is going to be good um, we have the coins the pentacles the heart sign on Tuesday and Wednesday and then we have the sword, the eight of sword. Um, you know, you thoughts, a lot of thoughts are going through your head and then there comes an end to a situation and then you have the nine of pentacles and the chariot. This is wonderful. This is good. This is a positive, positive experience for each and every one of us. And we need to know that... Um, Whenever we send positive thoughts out, that is what we receive. This is a good, good message for you, Cancers, because what is happening at this moment for you, Cancers, it is that um, good, positive things are on the horizon. There is um, the energy of the Nine of Pentacles, and um, so you have an Earth and a Fire sign in the weekend, which is good. Nine of Pentacles and the Chariot, which is good. Um, this is very good. So the Six of Cups and the Six of Coins, um, they are very positive for you guys. Okay, so let's see what other messages are going on because um, this is going to be extremely good. Um, the Three of Wands, love is coming in. Um, the number three energies is going to be good, wonderful, positive messages are coming in. So here we go. We have the energy of the six of ones. And this energy of the six of ones is a very, very positive energy because this is good news. It's coming in. You have four times six here, two times three. Okay. So whatever that is coming up um, for you guys whatever that is coming up for you guys is going to be good wonderful positive news that will be coming in as we look at the energy of Monday Monday is going to be a very very good day because you're going to be connecting with and a soul someone who is your soul connection someone who's from your soul group this is going to be a very very good connection and they are going to be giving you money. They're going to be sending you money. So this is um, positive and wonderful. So whatever the situation is, whatever the experience is, you are going to see that the energy of uh, the um, page of pentacles is coming in. And this is going to be wonderful, positive news. We have the energy of the six of cups. And this is good because you're going to be connecting with someone from your soul family. And they are going to be helping you out financially and this is going to be positive on Tuesday a hurt energy hurt element this is good the six of coin this is extremely good um, the page um, came in about this money that will be coming into you and this is um, a very um, a positive in some sense he can be um, it's as if you're not going to receive the message about the money and in some sense, it's going to be a positive message that is coming in about the Six of Pentacles. Okay, it's as if the message um, for some people, uh, you're going to the, the message is going to be delay. So um, 
you need to understand and you need to find out what exactly is going on and how and why things are this way but it's going to be good because help is coming in and help is coming in in a positive way then we have the eight of Pentacles you're working very hard it's going to be a week where you're working very hard and some people are thinking about changing jobs career and that sort of a thing but at the moment you're working very hard to build something in your life and to bring that balance in your life and this is going to be wonderful and positive so whatever the situation is whatever has happened whatever has um, taken place you are going to see that balance is going to come in your life in a very very wonderful way so um, understand what is going on for you because there's going to be a transition um, you're working hard and this is going to bring positive um, situation in your life so this is going to be good Thursday is a day when we have the eight of swords where you're there's so many thoughts there's so many things going through your head and that sort of a thing and you need to understand that love um, new love is coming in do not worry about um, if, if for some people you're having a relationship and you're not trusting someone or you know and, and maybe it's it's because you have gone through so much you you know you are you're not putting your trust in everyone because you realize that you can't trust everyone and this is what is happening to you and you need to understand that love is coming for you and this is really true love okay um, it's not something it's, it's, it's really really true love as we look forward we have the energy of the ten of wands whatever the situation is whatever the burden was it finally comes to an end and you are trying to move forward okay the ten of wands comes on Friday so whatever that was happening the burdens that you are carrying a lot of people are going to realize that on Friday something finally is released on Friday and the energy of the three of Pentacles is coming in and this is going to be a very very positive as we move along we have the nine of um, the nine of um, coins and the energy of the nine of coins is wonderful because money on um, Saturday um, there is a message that is coming in about money a good message is on the way and this is going to um, tell you about um, money is coming to you and this is money that is going to help you to be financial balance in your life okay and then we move along and we have the energy of the chariot on Sunday this is good this is positive whatever the burdens was whatever that was happening you have a good strong foundation and you have the energy of the chariot and this is what happened is uh, um, this this happens because um, whatever you were going through um, the universal angels and guides have helped you to come out of the situation and you you know you have always have a strong foundation whatever it was you have always have a strong foundation you know um, within yourself and you are you know strong and your angels and guides saw that things were not in balance and they have helped you and you finally release your burden and you're coming out and you're coming out on top the, the, the energy of the chariot is a victory and success and the four of ones is, is a celebration after a very very um, horrible um, situation that that was there that was entering you and with that energy of the chariot which is one of the most beautiful cards for Sunday whatever you're thinking about doing on Sunday it is a good idea and you have no um, you have no despair it's uh, um, adversity against uh, um, you know uh, um, probable problems and that sort of a thing overcoming conflicting and into a success with um, you know positive successful thing and the good passage through the journey of so many things that was happening and working against you and finally you have successfully overcome this and this is good so whatever the problem is whatever the situation is of was that has caused you this may in your life you know it is going to be good the four of ones is romance you know society harmony newly um, 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 and, and prosperity 
a tranquil the fruit of your labor is now showing up so this is going to be a time when life is going to seem to shift huh? the six of one the six of ones is always the conquest the triumph good news advancement uh, expectation and desire realizing a result of your effort and this is extremely good so whatever the situation is whatever the problem is whatever is happening for you this is uh, a, a situation that has played for so many times there um, and now you're coming out on top because through perseverance and being just upfront being honest being you know doing what it is that you need to do you are going to come out on top and this is going to be positive for a lot of people so whatever the situation was whatever that was happening um, whatever that has played in your life uh, good news is on its way and it's going to be positive news that is coming in um, as we look at the, f the first half of the week you have the six of Pentacles and the six of cups which is six of Pentacles it's as if you're going to connect to a group of people that is going to help you six of ones is here twice so it's going to be double whammy good news that is coming in and the four of ones with the chariot is saying two victorious success over whatever diversity that has paled, um, play against you and this is what we should be all be thinking about because we have gone through so much in our lives and finally finally at the end of uh, um, our journey we have finally overcome all the obstacles that was there and the obstacles that people have paces love is going to be very significant new love is coming in um, you need not to worry because I've seen a lot of people worrying about a relationship and that sort of a thing and you need not to worry about the situation because by worrying about the situation you're going to understand that uh, um, you need to change um, the way you look at things and the way that you accept things and you need to understand that life is full of surprises but yet still we need to understand where we are at this moment okay and you need to be flexible whatever the situation is whatever that is occurring in your life at this moment you need to be flexible you need to go with the wind you need to learn to go with the wind you can't be um, standing um, you know um, and, 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 and expecting their loyalty their friends who are very loyalty they are loyalty people even though we have gone through stuff and we um, tend to stay away from people and don't want to connect with people but not everyone is the same and it is hard whenever you have lost the trust in people and humanity and you but you need to learn to be flexible because it's not one of the most easiest thing to be flexible because I I've gone through situations where I trust no one and then I realize that I, I need to um, you know not everyone is the same and um, you know people will say you know you can't just close yourself off and be an island because you can't always stand alone okay so flexibility is teachable open-mindedness being adaptable without comparison what's most important okay a tree root or a solid plant in the ground yet its branch can be bent in a hurricane where a rigid structure like a building would come crashing down consider how the trees remain um, stir and secure when everything around it is being um, in shambles this is how you need to be now willing to learn new things teachable marvel yet still firmly ground in who you are common sense is important but so is an open mind stay curious stay open stay aware at this um, time others will be more flexible with you okay so honestly people um, um, each and every one of us that does reading and I can say for myself each and every one of us that does reading everybody thinks that our lives is perfect but our lives are not perfect it's because we have gone 
through so many horrific things in our life, most of us, that is uh, not most of us, but a handful of us, um, that goes through so many things in life. And um, this is why we decide to try and help other people. Well, that is my mission um, because I have dealt with so many things and I can't imagine that um, uh, um, everyone, I've always looked at people and thought everyone has a story. It doesn't really matter what is your story, but everyone has a story. So that is how I look at life and I respect people for who they are and understand that each and every person on this planet has a story and it doesn't matter if it is a story where um, you have gone through life without um, any problems or whatever because most of the people that have gone through horrific things in their life came in to help other people and they had to go through those circumstances in their life so that they can become flexible and understand who you are as a true person and that is what built your character to make you be stronger so whatever is happening which is not a bad week for you guys it's a good week it's a positive week but you have to learn to be flexible because sometimes you cancers are so rigid and you need to be flexible and I must say I've seen that you guys have gone through so many um, things in 2015 and 2016 and this is a positive readings for and I am wishing you a very wonderful week namaste and remember not all of us are perfect I am not perfect no one is perfect because we all have or um, troubles and, and, and trials to go through but um, if I can go through it and be strong for someone else, that is how I'm changing the vibration of the humanity. So have a good day.